Hey everybody, Judy here from Judy's Handmade Creation. And here's a crochet hair bandana that I made. This crochet hair bandana was made with this pattern here. You get it from Michaels. And it's got what kind of yarn that you should use on there. But I didn't use that kind of yarn. I used this kind of yarn from the Dollar Tree store. And this is just cut, Premier is just cotton. Yarn and it's for crafters, makers, knitters, and crocheters. It's got 104 yards, and it's got 2.1 ounces. So you will need one of these plus another ounce out, about another ounce out of this. So that's how much I have out of the second one. I used a whole one plus about an ounce out of this one. And the crochet hook that I used was, it's a clover, and this is a H hook, and it's a 5.0 H hook, and it's a clover hook. And this is, it came out the size that it, that the gauge was. This came out to, with this yarn, it said it should measure 11 inches from here down to the end of the point. And then 22 inches, it should be long. So let me take it off and I'll show you. I can get it all. And it's like this. That's the strings that you tie it with. And it's like a triangle. And this is a crochet hair bandana. And it's easy to put on. Just tie it from behind the hat. And this is cotton. You can wear it in the summer. And to keep your hair from blowing all around. I can't see what I'm doing. Just tie it in the back. And there you go. Got a nice little hair bandana to wear. And they have this yarn my Dollar Tree store, they have this in pink, white, blue, and cream. And this is a Premier Just Cotton yarn. And you get 2.1 ounces of this for $125. Thanks for watching. Be blessed. Bye-bye. Judy's Handmade Creation, and I'm adding this, some more, another finished project, and some whips to this video, and the blanket is finished, and it has this blanket can fit a twin size bed, or it could be a throw, well it be kind of, it's kind of heavy, it could be a throw for a couch, and I have a lot of whips that I'm still working on. So let me show you the blanket. Here's the blanket. And that's the edging that I put on it. And this is a lot of 
like springtime or summer colors. This was a lot of work. And I'll throw it out and let you see how big it is. And I'm moving around. This is how much that it doesn't cover the twin side bed over here. And this has got a lot of beautiful colors. Color the yarn. And I love it. Find me something finished. it again and then the edging it's a lot of work this one's finished I've been working on this for a while since the winter time this is loom knitting and this is gonna be a triangular shape shawl. Oh, here goes. I've been looking at it. This is going to be a shawl. This is how long I got it so far. This is like the corner, the corner of it. That wraps around your shoulders. And that's how, how much I went around the loom. I gotta go all the way around here and then I gotta start decreasing stitches all the way around. So I still got this one to work on. And the um, yarn that I used here is uh, that Barnett. Um, I'm gonna pick it up. This is the Barnett yarn. That's at, um, I think it's a five or a six. Another skin of this yarn. I'm still working on this one. I'm not finished it. I'll let you see it. This is a work in progress. Put it back in its bag. I can keep up with it. Yep, I got that one that I got to finish. I got another summer cotton one. And another project bag. And I got this one here. I got one panel done. I think this panel is done, ain't it? Yeah, this is one panel done. That's one panel done. Working on this panel. I have two panels. It's going to be like a, a shirt cover up. I'm going to finish these. I got this panel done already. And then I'm working on this. This is going to be like a mesh cover up for a tank top. I'm going to finish this one. And I'm using the cotton premier yarn from the Dollar Tree store. This one here. Premier cotton yarn. That's what I'm making this one with. I 
And which one didn't I show you? I got this one. This one here going on. I'm using this kind of yarn here. Look at this. This panel done. Black is hard to see. So you won't be able to see the stitching in it. That's one panel. And I gotta finish this panel here. I got it where it won't come out. And that's all the ones that I'm working on. And I like this book here. This is a nice book if you don't have it. It's got a lot of crochet stitches in it. That's a nice book there. You can learn a lot of different crochet stitches. It says all you need to know about crochet. Difference. I love this book. Right. Yeah, that's about what I'm working on and my finished stuff. I gotta keep them together because of the mess. I won't know what I'm going to be doing. Thanks for watching. Be blessed. Bye bye.